Welcome guys, this is Data Slash Fun YouTube channel. Today we will see how to do interactive animation plot in R Studio. So that, please guys subscribe this YouTube channel for getting latest update in data science and press bell icon for getting latest video notification. So let's see how to do interactive animation plot in R Studio. For plotting animation plot, you need to install some packages first package is breakdown first package is sorry ggplot2 then breakdown and plotly ggplot2 is plotting the interactive plot breakdown package contain hr data so we will use hr data for animation plot and plotly for making this type of pointer and play button So end of this video, you will learn how to do interactive animation plot in your R studio. This type of graph you will learn to how to do in your R studio. So that please guys like this video because you get some valuable knowledge from that video. Let's continue. First, you need to recall these libraries by this command library ggplot, then library breakdown, then library plotly. Then just see brief of our data set. Data set is HR data set. First column in this data set is satisfaction level of employee, then last evolution, then number of project working with employee, and monthly working hours then time spent with company in year three year four six five then work accidents there is a zero means there is accident and one is sorry zero is there is no accidents one is there is accident then left left means employees working or not with company one is not working with company and zero is working with company then promotion in last five years zero there is a no promotion when there is a promotion sales means there are different type of department in a company so this column is related to different department like sales hr operation it salary there are three types of salary low medium high if you want to check the detail of data set then write this command question mark hr data and then it control plus enter so it will show the details of our data set you can see here how many rows how many columns and description of each and every variable so this data set contain 14999 rows and 10 columns let's start for plotting scatter plot by ggplot2 package here is a command p1 ggplot2 sorry ggplot in bracket hr data our data set then on x axis satisfaction level and on y axis monthly working hours so basically we will see the relation between satisfaction level and average monthly hours working and this relation will be differentiated on left column why i write this as dot factor because left column is in integer type so i want to this in factor category type so that's why i write here command as dot factor then plus sign and geom underscore point is for scatter plot on axis frame is equal to time spent with company by this command you can make this type of play button and this relation will be move on the basis of another variable time spent with company plus labs in this labs command you can give the x-axis y-axis title or graph title here is a i uh, mentioned here title is equal to analysis of employee attrition this title must be in double code just run it it will give the simple ggplot not so interactive but only simple ggplot by this command ggplotly this our p1 plot object it gives the interactive animation plot
see here is a play button here is a pointer so it will show the each and every detail of point by pressing play button it will change accordingly with our third variable time spent with company and you can do it manually also by pressing online on three years of experience the relation of average monthly hours with satisfaction level is this type then after five years it's change so you can see the pattern of attrition on which region various employees are living with company or which are left after seven there are much more attrition there is one so attrition and zero is there is no attrition so by plotly you can do this up this type of animation plot the next we see this relation on the basis of salary type low medium high so let's see here is a command p2 ggplot same command hr data or data set axis on x axis satisfaction level on y axis average monthly hours and color of point will be differentiated on one variable as dot factor left then for scatter gom underscore point and axis frame is equal to time spent with company plus facet underscore wrap by this command this graph will be differentiate on the basis of salary type low medium high plus labs title is equal to analysis of employee attrition it will give the simple gg plot not animated by this command gg plotly p2 it will give the animated plot here is a play button and pointers also by pressing play button it will be changed automatically on the basis of years of experience 2 years 4 year 5 years and so on you can analysis directly on this graph on 3 years there is a pattern in low and medium and here is a high here is also one pattern is recognized after 6 years same pattern is repeated so by uh, analysis by the analysis by this graph hr team is easily uh, recognize where is the uh, attrition happen on which uh, relation with respect to this uh, average monthly hours or satisfaction level so majorly this region and this region very large amount of attrition is happen so they will plan accordingly and take a decision to save their business so by this graph you can do direct analysis of employee attrition so if you like this video please press the like button and if you have any challenges with the coding and anything then please write on this video and please subscribe this youtube channel for getting latest update in data science and tricks like this so thank you so much for watching and please share this video with your friends so they will also get the valuable knowledge thank you so much